I'm David Gravel, driver of the Houston Speedway, Billion Automotive, Jackson Motorplex, Big Game Motorsports number two. I reside from Watertown, Connecticut. I've been driving since I was six years old. Uh, I started in quarter midgets. I raced those from six years old to about 13 in 2005. Uh, from there, we went to 270 micro sprints, raced at a track called Whip City uh, in Massachusetts. From there, we graduated up to Pennsylvania, running there weekly with the 600cc micro sprints. From there, we went to the URC Sprint Car Series in, I think, 2007 and 2008. Uh, it's actually the oldest sprint car series in America. Um, from there, we hopped on the All-Star Tour, helped from JRT Transportation, uh, became partners with my dad and family team, and uh, made it all happen to get on the All-Star Tour for four seasons. Uh, from there, we dabbled in a pick-and-choose schedule uh, with the World of Outlaws and All-Stars. My big first break was driving for Ross Motorsports, and we won our first two out of four outlaw races uh, during the schedule. And uh, from there, I felt like my career really uh, came along, and I've been on the World of Outlaw Tour ever since then. We were Rookie of the Year in 2013. Today, we're in 2023. So it marks my 10th year on the World Vol Law Tour, which is pretty crazy. I'm 30 years old now and uh, have a son, and you know, very fortunate uh, for everything that's happened in my career. Had a lot of lucky breaks and uh, won some big races along the way as well. Really looking forward to the opportunity and what we have here moving forward. I feel like I'm in the prime of my career and uh, prime to hopefully get Todd his first championship in, in Knoxville National. I got to thank my family and my support system, my wife. Mom and dad and my two sisters, I mean, I'm very blessed. I feel like I am the human I am today because of my parents raising me. And uh, my wife, she sacrifices a lot. She has her own career as well. And with raising a son, it's definitely been a little overwhelming lately. But we're learning as a family, growing as a family, and I can't thank all of them enough. But it's year 10. We're ready to get a championship. So we're going to get after it this year and see what we can do.